Welcome back to TMAC FPV, your home for your journey to better FPV fun, flights, and racing stuff. If you're new to the channel, welcome. And I want to point out, we're both beginner-friendly and family-friendly. We do our best to pass on FPV beginner tips, FPV tutorials, fun flights, and more, while making it both informative and maybe a little entertaining. So if you haven't done so already, click on that subscribe button and share this TMAC FPV channel with your friends. In our last video, we covered how to set up and use GPS Rescue Mode on our Micro FPV quadcopter, the Flex RC Kluge. We showed how there are two ways to activate GPS Rescue Mode, one being manually with a switch, which we demonstrated, and the other way was automatically through setting it up as our fail-safe option, which we did not demonstrate at the time. Within both of these activation methods, there are a few scenarios we went through which can happen depicted on this chart, and we made both this chart and the GPS Rescue Mode setup checklist available to you for free through the link in the video description below. If you missed that setup video, it's worth a look, and you can check it out through the pop-up card above, or also through the link below. Today we do a follow-up to that video based on our two comments of the week from two of our TMAC FPV teammates. The first one comes from Sub250G FPV who states and asks, TMAC, your FPV how-to videos are among the best on YouTube. Very clear and very concise. Thank you, Sub250G. My TBS Crossfire module displays the GPS coordinates of my quad, but I only really use GPS to show the distance I've traveled. One other question, TMAC, can you disable it via smart audio? The second one comes from our friend Jason Lombatis, who comments with, Great info, TMAC. Well, thank you, Jason. I went to set one up, but I think I got a bad one from Banggood. Next time, I want to see you turn off the transmitter to simulate a real failsafe. <laughs> I bet you do, Jason. I think Jason may have been halfway joking and halfway really looking forward to a TMAC FPV disaster. Everyone loves an epic fail, right? Anyway, we're going to quickly address and answer both of these comments today. So stick around and let's find out how it goes. All right, the first thing I'm gonna show you is how to activate and deactivate the GPS rescue using smart audio. Go to features, fail safe, and the procedure right now is on GPS rescue. You just flip the switch, change it to drop, flip it back, set it to GPS rescue. Save and exit. Okay, what I'm going to do is fly along this road for a while. And I'm going to, to induce a failsafe, I'm going to turn the transmitter off. At which point the quadcopter should spin and, and climb to 70 meters and start flying back to me. Shortly after that, I'll flip this switch to put the GPS in GPS rescue mode before I turn the transmitter back on so that when the transmitter is on, it's automatically in GPS rescue mode so that I've got time to recover from it. We'll see how this works. Turns out this GPS rescue failsafe mode worked pretty well. Take a look around at the areas you normally fly in. Based on the objects in and around these areas, what altitude and distance from home would you put in your GPS failsafe settings? Let us know in the comments section below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Remember to grab your free GPS setup checklist and activation flowchart from the link in the video description below. Share this video with your friends through social media 
and remember to subscribe. Thanks for your time. We'll see you in the next video. Clear skies, friend.